Hello guys and welcome back to Minecraft Mega Construction City Edition, the long awaited return with me, Peter Plum. And me, Howling Musty. So, Corey, so, so in this episode, what are we gonna be doing? Well, I've sort of been building some stuff adding to the world since we last did the mega construction, which I believe was at the water park. Because I feel like and when was... was the last time we actually did a video on Minecraft Mega Construction City Edition? I feel like it's been I think we uploaded it a few months ago, but we recorded it like sometime last year. Yeah, so well, I, think, on... I think it's definitely been like it's, it's kind of mad thing that this world is now officially six years old. I can't, I almost can't, can't quite believe it. We've had like almost well, six birthdays on this world at this point. But yeah, yeah I mean, the old, got... the old city hall over there, back, built back in 2018, you know. That's it. I mean, we've got Daily Bugle over there as well. That was a more recent episode. We've got Westy Spoon. We've got McMorgans. But uh, yeah, down the end of the high street, I've sort of been adding some stuff to the world. Because I feel so, like we have some pretty nifty stuff, if the chunks load, uh, over in the new area. So we have... I mean, I'm sure what, what, what you mean, Corey, is this uh, uh, Frankie Fazbear's Pizzeria, right? Sure oh, I mean, this is already here, but... I mean, uh, I'm, I'm sure yeah. this is exactly what you wanted to show us, right? <laughs> <laughs> what, I, what I wanted to show you was my recreation of the largest sundial in Europe. Don't you mean the second largest sundial in Europe? Pretty sure it's the biggest, I'm not sure. But I thought it was the second biggest. I mean, it's the, big, it's the biggest sundial in Minecraft, I'm pretty sure. I mean, oh wow, I don't even know if you've actually gone and done all these, the, um, what do you call it, the actual, uh, the numbers of the clock face actually in chisel and bits, wow, that is a... Uh, I did, uh, yeah, I had to dig into them with gold and it sort of took a while to do. Okay, that, yeah, so that definitely, it's one thing I do not have the patience for all the time for is, uh, Chisel bits. The, uh, but I thought, uh, you know, pay pay homage to a nice Nottinghamshire landmark. Yeah. And put put a nice little market around it as well, so it's got a function to the city. I mean, I do feel like we are missing a few of the uh, the locals. You know, the uh, <laughs> yeah. You know, we're, miss we're missing. <laughs> it's it's the capital of common sense, as some would call it. The capital of common sense. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I am liking the uh, the plums you got going on here from Pam's Harvestcraft. I one yeah, I thought, I thought the plum trees in in honour of one of the founders of the city. Yeah, I mean that's uh, I uh, man, I'm still not complaining. Like, I don't know, how long did this take you, man, with there with chisel on bits? Oh, the the sundial that I built in chisel, it took quite a while. I, I can kind of imagine it being one where you can kind of like sort of build, like you've got like a repeating block that kind of goes along, right? And then you just you, you have to do the uh, the ends. Um, am I right? But yeah, to, to sort of explain this for anyone who doesn't know, in, in Nottinghamshire there's a town called Sutton in Ashfield, and it's home to the largest sundial, or at least it was at one point, in Europe, and that's sort of what I've tried to recreate. Yeah, well, I mean, I'd say it looks pretty neat, man, honestly, like, um, Would you say it's like... an accurate, an accurate depiction? Yeah, I'd say that, honestly, I'd say that's pretty good, man, honestly, like, I'm, I'm pretty impressed, I'd say, like, generally. Cool, cool. Well, obviously behind the sundial, we've we got have... the sundial cinema. We have Il Cinema. Il Cinema. I mean, the last time we did a cinema in mode construction was season two, I believe. I think that was back in the old 1.8. Um... I think that was 1.8. Oh, eight. you've actually got the uh, the TV. Is this the, the new uh, web displays mod you were talking about? This is the web displays mod, yeah. I wanted to use it out, oh, out know, in the, can, uh, we... the conception. You can zoom in and even kind of... Oh my god, that is functionality I did not expect to exist. Well, what I've done, if you if you have an empty hand and you shift click on it, it's a URL to a GIF that I think I've put on this. Oh, okay, okay. I mean, so, cause, so do these work like the... Um, I'm sure we've done these before right, with the TVs in the houses, right? We have like the... they hook up to like a GIF. You have, that's part of the deco craft mod, I believe, yeah, yes. but the thing with the web displays mod is you can sort of do it to any website, so it doesn't have to just be a GIF. I, I'm guessing, so what, at least with this mod works, it's kind of, you can put them kind of in whatever, you know, you sort of put the the blocks down in whatever configuration, you can make it, the screens kind of as big or as little as you want, right? You can make them any aspect ratio you want, I believe. I think there is a minimum size of 2 by 2 oh, okay. But... Yeah, I mean, we've got the concession stand over here as well, which has some nice stuff in it. 
What I will okay. say about the web displays mod is unlike the TVs in DecoCraft, um, you can embed YouTube videos on them, which I think you might see when we go through to the cinema screen in just a second. That, you know what? You've got me pretty excited. Like, I am... I've looked forward to that. Like, I'm liking the um, use of the, the mechanism tanks to have the, uh, the Coca-Cola and the Fanta on the game. <laughs> I'm definitely liking that. That's a nice touch. I've got the, uh, the nice fridges with nice dispensers and some cabins. Of course, uh, would you like a ticket to this uh, special screening of A Quest for Plum Labs? You know what? I would like two tickets, please. I am doubly excited. Well, let me just grab your ticket, sir. Yeah, I will clear my uh, hotbar in anticipation. Oh, yeah, you've even got actual... <laughs> What's this, like, sort of... So this, I set up a lighting rig in the ceiling. If you just want to come out and look. Oh, I'm guessing is that is that what the uh, the levers for? Oh this my sort god! Sort this of is... wirelessly, <laughs> it's wirelessly hooked up, so that if I press it, it will turn all the lights off. Dan, you know that is that is nifty, man. That is. So if you uh, if you sit down in one of the seats, Please I will don't start. Please tell me this is it. actually gonna work. Oh, oh no! It never <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Oh. So, so it literally, oh. it actually... It... Hold on, oh, I'm, no. I'm, I'm going to try and get a different URL. I, mean, um, we, we, I think all these, we'll, we'll have a break, I think we're having some you know, technical difficulties at the, uh, the cinema. And we're back guys, after a, a few spots of technical dif difficulties, it looks like the movie is finally ready for, uh, ready for showing. Do you want to uh, kick us off then, Corey? Absolutely. We're all sitting comfortably. This is just... Oh, I genuinely never would have thought there would have been a mod, especially for like a version of Minecraft this old, where somehow you can genuinely... Like, just to clarify, this is actually in the actual game. This isn't even... This isn't edited on top nor the sound. This is literally coming through the actual game. It is absolutely insane. I mean, you could probably prove that as well if you, like, get out of the chair and walk right up to the screen. Yeah, like, like look, this kind of... So it's hundred percent isn't the editing. This is literally like an actual screen with a, a YouTube URL. Um, and I'll, uh, I'll even turn the light on as well, just so you can see the whole auditorium where we watch. But did you ever think it'd be possible for us to be watching an episode of Plum Labs inside Mega Construction City Edition? I mean, uh, it's absolutely insane. Like a genuinely. I mean, I sort of feel like it, in a way, it's almost like a very... I'm not even really sure to like it, I haven't really got to the modding experience to kind of know whether this is a, an easy or a, a difficult feat to pull off, but... To be able to embed YouTube videos into Minecraft and watch them literally in the game is absolutely insane. Like, this is... in the actual reception area here, so it's not really... It is pretty crazy, isn't it? That is genuinely insane, like, I honestly can't... Because effectively, it is like a fully functioning like browser, essentially, isn't it? You can kind of go through and you know you can watch, I don't know, yeah. Minecraft we, Mega Construction City Edition. Although people. it does seem to have, I think it does have a few problems server side in terms of getting videos to actually play, um, but I think it's a little bit temperamental. Um, uh, but... Click the subscribe button to see caps. If you want. <laughs> I mean, have have you seen how many subscribers we now have? Okay, guys, so just to kind of sort of end things off, we've got a howling Westy Cliff and absolutely you classic. You don't stand a chance. Yeah, and, and I do want to say if we just like step outside and have a fly around a bit, um, it is quite a nice functional build, isn't it? Yeah, it is quite, it's, it's a very nice, kind of clean, crisp. Um, wow, I feel like it's sort of almost bigger on the outside. I like it's kind of, I feel like because it's all. You, I'm imagining, you know, obviously got a lot of kind of redstone stuff to kind of contain, so you've had to sort of build it bigger uh, on the outside. But down that's there, exactly. Like, yeah. But down there, is, I really like that man. That's a really nice. Yeah, that's. that's uh, in terms of yeah, and I don't feel like we got we... to have a, a great look at the market. Obviously, you got like a bombs shop, a toy shop, right, I mean, everything you need in, in the town, such as this glorious one. You know, like a, a TNT shop. You know. Uh, your antiques, you know, your uh, cakes. Wood and fire. A fire shop. And it's even got a fire alarm as well. Oh, that's loud. But anyway, guys, I think that it's about the wrapping up.
point for the video. But thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. I mean, I'd say, if you, to be honest, Corey, I'd say out of all the builds we've had, that's probably up up there in terms of just from a functionality point of view. I don't think we've had a more kind of life functioning as builders as that cinema, to be honest. Um, so thank you for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. Goodbye from Post Plot. And hello, Musty.